confusion in Kaduna community as suspected gunmen killed cleric and community leader. Kaduna State government has confirmed the killing of a cleric in Igabi and a community leader in Gemma local government Kaduna State confirming the incident on Saturday Commissioner, Minister of Internal Security and Home Affairs, Kaduna State, Mr. Samuel Aronwa, said the security agent informed the Kaduna State government that armed bandits invaded Karawan Rafi village, village in Igabi local government area and killed one Dan Laman Isa, the chief imam of the village. According to the statement, the bandit moved straight to Isa residence and in what appeared to be a premeditated murder, shot him dead and left the location without taking any item or hostages. The murder of the cleric has been linked to his vocal stance against the killing and kidnapping of citizenry by bandits. It is of a similar link to the killing of Ado Musa Lai of Kajuru local government who was kidnapped and killed by armed bandits in October 2020 for his advocacy against killing, kidnapping and cattle rustling. Also similar was the shooting of Ado Amadu Sulaiman by bandits Kasuma Magani, Kajuru local government leaving him with bullet wounds and statement for the said in another development security agencies have reported the murder of the sakin yaki of godogodo mr jahana abu by a gang of kidnappers thank you for listening to this news You see what is amazing me most in this uh, uh, killings going on in Kaduna or these uh, strange things happening in Kaduna is that despite all these things that are happening, despite all these strange, strange things happening, um, Erufai doesn't see them as anything. He doesn't see them as any strange thing at all if you tell him that look mister your your state is on fire we tell you that no it's not my state that his state is at peace that nothing is happening in kaduna that kaduna people are very much okay that why the bandits are disturbing other northern states that his own state that nothing is happening there can you imagine a governor of a state you don't know that your people are in trouble you don't know that your people are under attack i will not blame you why i won't blame him is because he is a governor so he has the maximum security around him guiding him and the children and his children you see that so you will not blame him so why will he bother about the people of the community why will the affairs of the people of the community bother him they won't bother him because they are not his children they are not his relatives they don't they don't matter any a matter to him the people that matters to him are his own family his own family his siblings his children his relatives they are the people that matters to him you can imagine a statement from a governor you don't even know what your people are going through you don't know what the people are passing through you don't know that daily on daily basics you the the, the, the in Kaduna they kill people in numbers look at the people that have left their farm for bandits just because they, they, they threaten uh, they threaten them to pay ransom and I know that he Erufai will not still know about that that his own people have been charged to be paying ransom to be paying 
before they can be able to harvest their own crops, the crops that they planted themselves with their head and money. You will not still know about that. Is that not a disgrace? And you call yourself governor, the governor of the people. They can, look, these are the people that voted you. These are the people that wasted time. They, 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 they were under the sun, you know. They, they, they were under the sun waiting to cast their vote for you, believing that you will represent them well and speak on their behalf when there is need. They never knew that you will later turn your back on them and won't even bother about their existence. I knew it already from the onset that you you Erofi will never be a good governor to people of Cardona State. They called you a small bed. You are you you you, you threaten fire and ice and, uh, and 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 decide to take the person to court. But you on your own know how to insult and embarrass people. You and the Lailai Muhammad. Don't worry. The world are watching you people. They are watching you. Let's see how you succeed in this your presidential ambition. Let's see. Let's see how possible that is going to be. Mm -hmm. Let us see then. Hmm. My viewers, you got to be careful. The people of Kaduna got to be careful because the way things are going in Kaduna, I'm afraid. These people have taken it up with them and they are ready to wipe them out at any time. You understand? They will <laughs> My viewers, why are we talking much about this? Why are we talking much about this? It is not left to them. It is left to them. Whatever they feel that is right to do, let them do. Understand? Let them do. Because they are seeing their fellow states and community coming up with security outfits and they are still looking like morons. Mm -hmm. Well, my viewers, what's your take on this news? Do me free to leave them below the comment box. Click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to receive more updates. Thank you.